My name is Maria Pramo, and I'm here with James, and we're going to talk about Anime Club. How are you doing today? I'm doing pretty good. So huh. what is Anime Club? Anime Club is kind of just an after-school activity, which people can come and visit at any time. Um, we're really nice there. We kind of treat each other like family. It's, um, and we j watch anime. We discuss like different topics. We do a bunch of fun stuff, like games, have parties, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, and it's overall just really, it's a really fun experience. All right. And when and where are the meetings? Um, you can find us in room 247 um, every other Thursday okay. after school. All right, and why do you think people should join? People should join. Um, the reason I got into anime is because it was my freshman year and I didn't have a lot of friends. So I kind of just went in and I was, I was kind of nervous the first time, but people should just join it because it's a, it's a very welcoming community mm -hmm. and it's very easy just to come in, have a good time, meet a bunch of cool people and have something to look forward to every now and then. All right, and do, can you just walk in, or how do you join? How oh, you, you come in, you say you like anime, and we accept you as a family member, basically. Right. There's no procedure or anything. All right, and who runs the club? Um, I'm the president. Mm -hmm. um, my friend Jimmy is the vice president so far, and we don't really have any other like uh, staff or other members at this point. Well, not members, but um, like, positions to take, but I'm right. looking to change that um, coming up. All right, and how long have you been in the club? I've been in it for uh, freshman and sophomore years, two years, and this is, this is my first year being president. All right. What's your favorite type of genre? My favorite type of genre is the shonen genre and mm -hmm. fantasies. And what is that? <laughs> the shonen <laughs> genre, um, I don't really have a great way of explaining it, but a couple examples are like your, your, your Naruto, your uh, Dragon Ball Z, your one Piece, your Boruto. Are that those like shows? Or yes, those are all okay. um, very, very popular um, right. anime shows that have run for a very long time. Mm -hmm. um, they're kind of like, they're kind of like the, I would say the building bricks for anime almost because they give a great example of what exactly anime is. Okay. Um, and what exactly anime is, is that it's, um, well, at least for the shonen genre, for mm -hmm. example, is that it's a lot of um, action. It has an amazing storyline for the most part. Um, um, en very enjoyable and um, sometimes relatable characters. Okay. Um, yeah, that's that's a probably a good summary of what it is. All right. And uh, what other genres are there? Um, basically, in anime, there's the same type of genres that well, mostly the same type of genres you could find in any other movie or show. So like, mm -hmm. uh, there's horror, there's fantasies, okay. there's comedy, action. Um, uh, what else is there? Shonen, I already said that. Mm -hmm. uh, there's romance, there's um, uh, drama, stuff like that. All right. And do you, is there a genre you hate the most? Genre I hate the most? I mean, <laughs> in general, I'm not that big of a horror fan. Um, right. I'm a, an incredible scaredy cat whenever yeah. I watch it, <laughs> whenever Halloween comes around. Um, so that's not my favorite, but I don't dislike it at the All same right. time. All right. And do you have a favorite type of anime? Favorite type of anime? Um, a again, would probably be in the shonen genre. My favorite show of all time is uh, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Okay. It's a great, phen phenomenal show. Everybody should watch it. All right. And um, is there like movies in anime? Is it just TV shows? Oh, yeah. Yeah, all the okay. time. Uh, when a series gets really popular, the developers will make a movie of it. But okay. most of the time it is um, goes from manga, which is the um, basically the best way I can explain it to people who don't know what manga is, it's basically the comic book version of anime. Mm -hmm. um, and then it goes... So there's just comics books too? Basically, comics. kind of. Okay. <laughs> That's the best way I can explain it. So it goes from the literature of manga, then it gets an anime a adaptation mm -hmm. of, the, of the manga. And then as the anime does really well, it goes to the movie. Okay. And can you name any type of movies there are? Do you uh, have a favorite type of movie? Um, some recent ones um, that are coming out, the um, the Konosuba movie, which is kind of like uh, ma kind of about like magic and adventuring, mm -hmm. that just recently came out. Um, there's the My Hero Academia movie, which is about superheroes, mm -hmm. which is really good. And I don't know when it's coming out, but an anime called Demon Slayer just got a movie announced, and I saw the trailer, and it looks really good so far. And that's also in the show and genre. All right, and for the clubs, how do you decide what you watch? What we watch, uh, every day we just do um, a vote and we'll see what the people want that day. So we get a lot of repetitive ones because people obviously like have a favorite show that they always yeah. want to watch. So it's like we get like One Punch Man and Death Note and a bunch of um, other shows that are like super popular. 
Um, but every day we just do a voting system and we see what, what wins. All right, and how can I start watching anime? Uh, <laughs> great question. Um, people are probably gonna hate me for this answer, uh -huh. but get into like some very basic anime at first. The okay. anime that I started watching, well, first like technical anime per se, is called Sword Art Online. Very basic concept, easy um, plot line to follow. Mm -hmm. Some other good ones are like Death Note or Attack on Titan. The, go for like the very um, like popular and popular genre, popular shows <laughs> that mm -hmm. have already aired and have like good reviews and good plot lines. But start basic and then you can work your way up to the more like complex right. um, types of shows. Okay, and where can I find anime? Where you can find anime? Um, um, two of the biggest anime streaming services right now. Uh, one is called Crunchyroll and the other one's called Funimation. Mm -hmm. uh, Crunchyroll um, has probably a more diverse um, uh, anime like types of shows you can watch um, compared to Funimation, but Funimation has um, both subbed and dubbed anime, so you can either watch them in Japanese with subtitles or in English. And some people don't like dubs, but I mean, I always appreciate a good dub every now and then. Well, what is that again? A dubbed anime is yeah. basically because animes are from Japan, they're spoken Japanese, so they take um, a dub is basically just the anime, but in full English. So, which do you think is better, dub or sub? Um, I. I probably watch more sub, so I would okay. say sub is better, just because like dialogue and plot lines, and sometimes when like a show gets dubbed, like you miss those important plot lines or oh, okay. some other plot, not plot line, some other like useless dialogue gets thrown in that isn't really necessary for that scene. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, do you have anything else you'd like to add? Um, in terms of anime, it's just I I love anime. Mm -hmm. I think it's a great thing. I, um, it's not for everybody, obviously. Yeah. Um, it's very hard to get into, but um, once you're into it really, it's kind of just like you signed a contract and there's no going back <laughs> really. You'll get sucked into a portal where there's no escape, but mm -hmm. I say that in the best way possible, I All promise. Right. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for talking with us. Thank you for having me. All right. So make sure to stop by room 247 every other Thursday for Anime Club. Now back to our host.